Hello everyone. Do you know is your water healthy or not? What is GDS and water connection? I'll explain you about. As we all know, our life is completely dependent on this basic need of every creature, which is water. We are having water maybe each hour, but do you think that is it healthy water we are having or not? Water is undoubtedly the most amazing solvent which we cannot live without and has many benefits. Water helps you in staying hydrated and makes sure that human body functions in a healthy way. However, clean drinking water is not always charm free and pure. There could be many kind of impurities which include heavy metals, chemicals and pesticides. Importance of TDS Healthy drinking water must contain adequate minerals which will keep you and your family healthy. At the same time, if it contains excessive minerals, then it could be become a problem for your body. Therefore, the drinking water should ideally have a balanced TDS limits. High level or low level of TDS is not good. TDS stands for Total Dissolved Solids. What is TDS? Total Dissolved Solids into the water. TDS refer to any mineral, salts, metals, cations or anions dissolved in water. The concentration of dissolved solid particles. It comprises in organic salts and small amounts of organic matter that are dissolved in water. The principal constituents are usually the cations, calcium, magnesium, sodium and potassium, and the anions, carbonate, bicarbonate, chloride, sulfate and particularly in groundwater nitrate. TDS meter device and units. TDS is expressed in units of mg per unit volume of water milligram per liter or also referred as parts per million ppm tds meters display the tds in parts per million 1 ppm indicates 1 milligram of dissolved solids per kilogram of water so now what is permissible range all levels of TDS in drinking water. According to World Health Organization, water that has the TDS level lower than 300 mg per liter is considered as the ideal level and excellent for drinking. TDS levels below 1000 mg per liter with its maximum concentration can be considered acceptable for drinking purpose. However, the parameter of acceptance for the minimum TDS of the drinking water sometimes differs and depends upon the circumstances. As per the Bureau of Indian Standards, the ideal concentration of TDS for the drinking water is lower than 300 mg per liter and the maximum limit that can be considered permissible is 600 mg per liter. However, in reality, people are still drinking water with the TDS much higher than the limit. People suffering from kidney disease should drink clean and pure water which should have TDS level lower than 100 mg per liter. However, there are many parts of the country where people suffering from kidney disease and don't get drinking water with that TDS level. There are other health conditions as well that require the patients to drink water having TDS level lower than 100 mg per liter. Water that has a very low TDS concentration is not healthy and should not be used for drinking purpose. It is due to the water's bitter taste as well as the absence of essential minerals that are important for human body. Goodness and taste of water with different TDS concentrations. Levels of TDS milligrams per liter. Let's see its rating. Less than 300 is excellent, 300 to 600 is good, 
600 to 900 is fair 900 to 1200 poor and about 1200 unacceptable various sources of tds mm -hmm. the fresh water flows on the ground or soil and dissolved almost every kind of minerals that are found in the ground or soil the ground or soil is usually polluted by wastage overflows chemicals and pesticides from the harmful toxins that are released from factories and homes when the same water goes through metallic pipes it accepts more solid particles that get dissolved in it similarly the groundwater passes through some layers of the soil and accepts and dissolves minerals as it passes the overall dissolved impurities that are now present in the water is called the total dissolved solids and simply tds TDS can be expressed in milligram per liter, where milligram stands for milligram mg and I no denotes the volume of the water, which can also be referred as parts per million or briefly ppm. Apart from this, the water contains other pollutants as well, such as mud, clay, and dirt. However, these pollutants do not get dissolved in the water. TDS has some very common chemical constituents such as iron, chloride, fluoride, potassium, sodium, nitrate, phosphates, and calcium. For comparison, it is useful to state that most aquatic system, ecosystem with different fish fauna tolerate TDS levels of 1000 mg per liter. Now let's see diagram. How to treat TDS? Treating TDS depends on which solids are dissolved in the water. First, if TDS are calcium, magnesium or iron, a water softener should be used. Second, if concentrations of sodium chloride or potassium are elevated, reverse osmosis RO should be used as a water treatment and the third one for high to iron manganese arsenic concentrations or total hardness in general other methods should be used pure water is tasteless colorless and odorless and it is often called the universal solvent there are a number of water purification systems that are available today. The level of TDS in drinking water can only be controlled by the reverse osmosis water purification system. The reverse osmosis water purification system is undoubtedly the best system that removes harmful contaminants and impurities from water. Purifiers that would not only make your drinking water safe and healthy but also maintain the ideal TDS levels. With all the latest technologies such as ORPH+, UV, UF and RO water purifiers will effectively slash the TDS and deliver the best quality water that is safe, tasty and pure. I will make another video for further information about TDS and water and its effect on health. If you are liking my informational videos then click the subscribe button. Don't forget to hit a like. Share this informational video with everyone on your WhatsApp and Facebook. Express how would you like it by commenting down below. Thank you.